Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Netflix. In this video, I am going to explain you uh, what are the concepts of classes and objects in PHP and how we can create a class and a function in a PHP class and how to call that function. So let's start up the coding part. First of all, we need to create a class. I'm creating a class named sample and I'm going to create uh, the functions named show. In this function, I'm going to just add and I'm going to just print over here. Uh, I will making a another function in this function. Uh, we can just uh, like add up the things in this add function and in the show function, I can just simple uh, print. This is a show function. Inside the class sample. So there is a function at. Uh, we have two types of functions. If you want to uh, like uh, have detailed things on how to create a function, I have uploaded a video on my PHP tutorial playlist in which I am clearing up different types of function in PHP. So in this, I I am going to create a function with argument that will be taking up two arguments, and that two arguments I am going to plus and save in the variable c and here i can just put equal c uh, i can just here put the sum as equals to dot dollar c i'm going to save this where we are going to save this we are going to save this samp htdocs uh, we can create a new folder of classes and objects in php uh, we can say classes objects in php i'm going to save this file as sample.php so here my class is being created uh, there is a class named sample the function show in this function i'm going to just display a particular line and another uh, the add function which two arguments are passed a and b that a and b values uh, the whatever the value comes in a and b will be plus and the result will be stored in the c and i'm going to display the c variable so now we are going to create an another class uh, not a class we can create an another file in which i am going to include that file that is sample.php because in order to access the uh, the function from the class we need to create an object of that class so we can say it as class demo.php so include sample.php will uh, include as an inbuilt function of PHP in which all the class properties or all the this uh, coding will be included in this file. Now it's time for creating an object. So dollar uh, ob you have to create a new object, uh, whatever it should be start with alpha alphabet, not the number. Uh, and uh, now I will be defining the new keyword. The new keyword is a keyword that is going to create an object uh, into object that will pass a reference of sample class and the object will be initialized with the sample class. So here uh, I have created an object named OB uh, that will point to my sample class, this particular class. So with, of, with the help of this object, I am going to call this function. I have a function name show so here ob the show function and this way you can call it show function now if i'm going to just print this class in objects in php so we have a class demo uh, because sample is just going to create a class we are not going to display anything over here so we need to run the class demo.php file. So if I'm going to run class demo.php, it's giving me the error because I have not put the semicolon in the end of include function. So now uh, this is a show function inside the class sample because I have called a show function. And this way you can call any function that is placed inside your class and you can just fetch its output. And now it's the action, it's a turn for this add function. So to call the add function, I can just put a break over here. So to call an add function, I need to create ob add. And as we know that it has two arguments that it will be receiving. So I will be like putting here as 100 and 200. 100 will be passed to a variable and 200 will be passed to 
its b variable 100 plus 200 will be 300 and the value will be the result will be the sum is 300 so here your results is being displayed see a uh, class 1 objects are the very important part of your php because uh, if you want to learn some mvc frameworks like laravel uh, laravel uh, or you can say the front end frameworks like react angular js they all works in class 1 objects so it's a very important part to uh, clear the basic concepts of class 1 objects then only you can just like uh, have a very good understanding of all these frameworks so i hope you like my video do subscribe to my channel and get all the notifications of latest tutorials that i am going to upload on my channel thanks for watching my video